This will be an unboxing of the ROG phone. Excited for this one. So let's just slice this plastic open. Take this off. Okay, throw the plastic away. And I gotta say, this is definitely a very interesting box, as you can see. This hexagon shaped kind of box here. Look at that design right there. Check that out. And more of that design here on this part of the box. Very nice. ROG phone. Got your logo right here. Yeah, nice. Digging this box. Republic of Gamers, as you can see. All right, so how do I open this bad boy? Is it this way? Got this little flap here, and this says ROG Aerodynamic System. I believe this phone does come with a fan, so that's pretty cool. Don't see that on a phone too often. So how do I open this? Okay. Try not to damage it, you know? Okay, how do I open this? Oh, here we go. Nice. And then kind of opens up like a book, I guess. <laughs> oh, man. Woo! Look at this. Looks like we have, this is the fan unit here. This is the device, obviously, and this is probably where your hardware, your other hardware is, charging brick, your cables, etc. So let's go ahead and take a look at the phone. And this is the phone itself. Oops, upside down. Wow. This is cool. Let's uh, very carefully undo these plastics from the device. Okay, put that to the side. This is the phone itself. So you can see, I'm definitely digging the black and red theme going on. You know, this, who remembers the HTC Droid Incredible from like 2011? This phone reminds me of that for some reason, maybe because of the shape of the speaker grills. What is this? We don't want any decals on this phone. So gotta take this plastic off, okay? Put it right there. Now we're talking. Nice. Yeah, definitely a unique design to this device. Check out that cooling right there. Dual camera setup, fingerprint scanner. Turn this bad boy on. Does it have enough juice? It does. Powered by Android. We'll put the phone to the side for now. Let's dive in. Okay, here is the fan unit. Whoa, that was sick. Did you hear that? Republic of Gamers. Man, if that sound that this phone just made is any indication of how these front firing speakers sound, this is gonna be one bad phone. And I mean the good bad. Check out this fan real quick. Here's the fan unit, which attaches to the side USB port of the device. Put the fan to the side. And what else do we get here? Okay, this thing kind of separates. Let me put that away and... Oh, here we go. Is this how you... All right. Charging brick. Now this is a fat one. For sure, this is fast charging. Put that to the side. And then here, what are these? No idea what these are. Let me know in the comments. And this is your charging cable. USB type C to USB type C. Very nice. All right, enough of all that. Let's check out the main event, which is the phone. All right, let's breeze through setup real quick. Next, attention. Do not insert a Type-C cable into the lower colored port of the side mount ports. Internet connection. Yes, I will connect to Wi-Fi. So let us search for my Wi-Fi network. Here it is. Gonna enter my password. We are connected to Wi-Fi. Next. Know your privacy rights. Next. Okay. Agree to that, whatever. Setup is new. Checking for updates may take a minute or two. Checking information. Google sign in. Skip that for now. I just wanna get into the phone and skip the name for now. Google services. Okay, I'm gonna say no to that one. I agree. 
adding finishing touches. Protect your phone, set up face recognition, set up fingerprint, set up pin, pattern or password, or no thanks. Let's set up the fingerprint right now. Check out this very uniquely shaped fingerprint scanner in the back right there. Add a fingerprint next. Okay, locate fingerprint scanner. I know where it is. Okay, now let's do this right now. There's the scanner and let's do this. One. Okay, that was one, two. Okay. Okay, continue. Continue. Okay, now the outer part of my fingerprint, so I'm gonna do that right now. Finished. Wonderful. Next. Protect your phone, next. Set up air triggers. We'll set this up later, next. Register your ASUS product. We'll do that later, next. Sign up with Google. Okay, we'll, Google Drive promotion, we'll skip that for now. Data transfer, we'll skip that for now. Set up complete, done. New system update, nice. I like it when I open a brand new phone and already I get a new system update. Do I wanna update? Hell yeah. So I'm gonna download it right now. All right, we'll let it download in the background. Now this is an OLED display, a 90 Hertz OLED display. On this side of the phone is your power button volume rocker. You have a mic right here. On the back, check out the shape again, the design. I love it. This is your ROG uh, logo here, which is, I believe it's RGB, so you can set this up. Dual camera setup, fingerprint scanner, your vents for your uh, the cooling. Phone making noises, which is good. Republic of Gamers down here. Let's see on the bottom of the phone. Your USB Type-C port, another mic, a headphone jack, a very nice feature. And then here is your SIM slot. And I believe this one comes off. Pull this off so you can see. And those are the dual USB ports. This is your fan. And the fan should just plug in this way like so. And snaps onto the phone like that. You don't lose any of the ports because down here you have a USB Type-C port and a headphone jack. So when you're gaming, you're gonna be like this in landscape. You have reports down here for easy access. That right there, now that's sick. Gotta give it to ASUS on this. ASUS system update finally downloaded. So I'm gonna go ahead and reboot the phone now. Successful system update, very nice. Click okay. And we are in. So let's go to settings. Let's see how much storage we get out of the box. Storage and memory, 114 gigabytes available out of the 128. So let's go to X mode real fast, which is right here on the toggle. Press that, you're in X mode. Now you long press your game center where you can control your game profiles, the fan speed if you have the fan turned on, and also the aura lighting, which is turned on right now. So let's check that out. Flip the phone over and look at that. Changes colors. Very nice. So one thing I do want to test out is the speakers. Jack up the volume. Not bad. Sounds really, really good. Now real quick in comparison, let's compare the ROG phone, the ROG phone, to the Razer phone too, as you can see, backside of the phone. Definitely a much different design here on the ROG from the front, from the sides. So now let's compare the volume of the Razer phone. That was the Razer phone, here's the ROG. I don't know, they both sound pretty good. You let me know in the comments which one you thought sounded better. So let me know in the comments below what you want me to do with the ROG phone. Speed tests, camera tests, gaming tests, etc. Versus, for sure, the Razer phone. Let me know in the comments below if you want to see a speed test between 
these two beasts right here. Should be a fun video. Asus ROG phone. Got it in house. Thanks for watching. Peace out.